hey guys welcome back to my channel so my hair is basically I want to say stretched yeah because I washed my hair like about a few days ago and I just put it in these two braids because I wanted to stretch it out and I didn't want to style it just yet so it's basically stretched right now and from the title you already know how I'm going to style my hair. I'm going to be using my herbal oil. I use this every time because that's just bae. And then I'm going to be using the Aunt Jackie's Defining Curl Custard. It is purple. I'm going to do the back and then I'm going to come back and show you guys what it is that I'm actually doing. I'm going to go in with my herbal oil from Africa's Best. I'm going to put that in there. I put a lot because I'm going to put it in this whole big section. So that I don't forget like as I'm going through and just I feel like it's just better to just oil a one big section instead of like section by section only because I feel like when I do it section by section then it's too much oil and I don't want it to be like over saturated and I'm taking about this much and I'm putting it on the tips of my hair first and I'm making my way up you just start by twirling like you would do a finger coil right and then you twirl some more until you form a knot, right? When you form that knot, then you just keep twirling the hair around itself, pretty much. And as you're twirling, you're gonna tuck the new, the new twirl under what was here before. That's how you get this, the length. Twirl the hair like you would a finger coil, right? And then you just keep going tighter and tighter and you're going to feel it in your roots and that's when you turn and you'll start with this knot right here and you just keep it going and then you're going to see this and then you just keep tucking the hair under as you're twirling tuck under keep twirling and tucking under until you get to the very end of your hair and there's no more hair to tuck under so the tips of my hair are really stupid and that's why I'm putting the rubber bands because I don't want it to come out tonight. So once you finish twirling, make sure you tuck the tips under your hair and then you take the rubber band and you secure it. And I'm going to be showing you guys how I take it down. Okay, so you guys can have a closer look right here. You just take the hair and you untwist it in like the opposite direction that you twisted it in and you just pull it out. And then you slide down the rubber band with it so it doesn't disturb your curl pattern. Let me show you guys on this side. So you just unravel it. Let me take this. And you slide the rubber band down. So I'm going to take this piece right here. And I'm just going to loosen it. And then I'm just going to separate the curls. So that I don't disturb the curl pattern. Alright, so take the piece of the knot and then you just loosen it just the opposite way that you rolled it and then you're just going to split the hair. You do it like this so that you have as much definition as possible. Alright, and then I'm going to go to this side and do the same thing. So I'm just going to loosen it up. And then just start splitting up the hair. I'm just going to go in the roots and I'm going to lift it up. As I'm lifting my roots, I'm lifting them forward because I want my hair to fall to the front. And then the one here, I'm going to lift it towards the back because I want the part to show. So now I'm just going to do the rest with my hands. I'm going to go through. If I feel like um, some of the hair is too big, I'm going to split it up some more. I'm 
just keep playing with it until you get it to the way that you want it to be pretty much and y'all that is pretty much it like if you want more volume then you can just keep playing it like i am but if you want more definition then don't split it up as much and this is how it looks that is it for this video don't forget to like comment subscribe share with your friends and i'll see y'all next time